Hey everybody! Man, is it hard to believe it's halfway through the year, 2023. It's time for market stats. Let's know what the market's doing right now. So, kick it off. What's happening? Yeah, so um, some financial benefits of homeownership. So, building equity, long-term savings, building wealth, control over expenses, and strong credit history. In addition to that as well, there's some tax benefits that come along with homeownership. Things such as mortgage interest rate deductions, property tax deduction, imputed rent, profit from home sales. So prior to 08, if we're looking at this graph here, this is showing how we had foreclosures and short sales and it was showing you how many we had in that period of time. Now, if we're looking at pre-pandemic levels, you can see right here that it was 4% foreclosure rate. So between 2020 and currently, there was a mortgage moratorium where they didn't allow any foreclosures at all. So if we're looking at today, some people are thinking, well, hey, there may be a wave of foreclosures we're not even at the pre-pandemic levels, that doesn't look like it's gonna be the case. Now, on the second graph here, we can see prior to 08, so 04 to 08 here, this is called the Mortgage Credit Availability Index. So this pretty much means the higher it is, the easier the lending guidelines were. So they were pretty much giving loans out to anybody. So after 08, a lot of new rules came into play and a lot of the guidelines really tightened up and it became a lot more strict. So we're not going to really see any wave of foreclosures because you have to have skin in the game nowadays. So as we move forward in 2023, what is happening currently? I'll tell you what's happening. So if you look at the national statistics, the first graph is monthly inventory pre-unicorn years. What does that mean? Well, during the pandemic, uh, there was a big drop of inventory, which was 2.3 in 21 and 2.2 in 22. Well now, so far the national average is 2.9 months of inventory. Well that's fine, but you always wanna look at the inventory in your own backyard. So let's say Stark County, for example, as of May, we have 1.9 months inventory. So that's less than the national average. And then when you look at days on market, how long is it taking to sell a property? Well, in March it was 29 days, and as of April it dropped down to 22 days. And then you say, well, how many, properties are actually for sale in Stark County. Well, you only have under 800, 793. So in closing, as you can see, it still favors the seller. So there is a seller's market still, even though you hear the headlines that talk about all these nasty things in the market. I'm trying to clarify with my team, Zev Braun, Dom Fonte, and Dominic Fonte. So as you move forward, if you need more information, reach out to any of us at what number, Zev? 330-933-3258. You can call or text that. That, Dom? My phone number is 330-234-6204. And mine's 330-418-1535. Call or text or check us out on the web at dominicfonte.com. We have over 435 star reviews to see if you'll experience working with me and my team. Thanks for tuning in.